in our last video we have created this theory application using business application studio and uh, we have displayed some of the data in the tabular format and uh, used some of the ui annotations like uh, this header information and this search functionality in this video we will be seeing some more ui annotations and uh, we'll make this application a little more rich in the functionality so the very first thing what we will be doing is we will be adding a new column here which will show airline ids so we already have this carrier id here let's add it to our ui so if you want to add anything into ui you need to use the ui annotation ui dot line item and then what at what position you want to add so we have this airline at the very first position and on the second position we have airport from so i want to add in between these two so i'm going to add a number 11 so it will be after this 10 and before 20 so and then i will also put a label here which will say carrier id and activate this activated and uh, let's refresh the application okay so now i got the carrier id here but now our requirement is i do not want to have these two columns two separate columns i want these two fields to be combined in a single column okay so for that we have a annotation which is object model annotation and uh, one is ui annotation okay so let's see how it works okay so very first thing is what we want to do is we want to combine this carrier id with this airline name which we already have okay so copy this name this name you want to combine with this carrier id so we will copy this field name where the names are coming and then we will add a new annotation which is object model annotation dot text element so which text element you want to combine with this field we want to combine this text element this value whatever value coming into this variable we want to combine it so just put this value here and then where do you want to show this value so this will have american airline full text and this field will have your aa or the ids carrier ids basically where do you want to show it so i want first american airline and then in brackets the carrier id okay so for that we again have another ui annotation text arrangement now where you want to arrange the text first you want to have the text or you want to have the last means first the id will be there and then the text you only want to show the text or these are the other options available so what my requirement is i want to show the text first i will use this annotation okay now let's activate this and let's see the output okay so we are getting the output combined but the value is coming in the carrier id field okay this was already there so 
what we will be doing we will be removing this and we will change the caption for this column so let's remove the airline column and change the caption for this column airline name that's it activate and uh, refresh see now you got the airline name with the airline code as well if i search with amri the searching still works now same thing you can try with these two columns the departure airport and arrival airport we already have these two columns here so airport from is your departure airport and this is the name and airport to is the arrival airport and this is the name here okay let's try to add these two things here as well so again we will be putting the object model annotation dot text element and where will be my name so my name full name will be here and where do you want to show it so i want to show it on the first position okay similarly let's do it quickly for the other column as well so my text will be my text will be in this and i again want to show it the first location let's activate got activated and uh, refresh okay so now we got the airline names as well departure airport and arrival airport along with the name full name and the code as well that's all for now in this video if you like the content please subscribe thank you